Body now. My sister, but no day for I don't tire. Uh -uh. I beg and go me go kitchen. Bring very cold water. Bless you, I won't get a headache this morning. Headache. Oh, wow, sorry. Oh. Ah. But the wall be say, Madame never come down, come open the kitchen door since. So. In fact, I don't come here like five good times since six o'clock. She never come open the kitchen door. Okay, make her go rest more now. So I continue work. Sorry, hmm? yeah. Oshie. Sorry, my brother. Thank you, eh? Why don't you just answer that phone? It's the maid. Yeah, what if you want something? Well, honey, why don't you worry less about what the maid wants and start giving me what I want? Yeah, but it's distracting. Then but... focus, baby. Forget about the distraction and let's just concentrate on us. <laughs> baby. Look, I waited up till 1 a.m. for you to return. I must have passed out as usual. I would have known. <coughs> Honey, look. I am fagged out. I got in at 2 a.m. in the morning. You know, the meeting was just draining. Just dragged on. You know, the, getting the Indians to trust that we deliver the project on time. Honey, See? honey, please, I don't want to talk about the Indians or work. Look, babe, you're here with me. And that's what matters. I want you to need me as much as I need you. But we've spent more time talking. Honey, can't you feel how much I need you? But baby, I do. But I'm beat. I am. Look, I have an early start today and I just came to check up on you. You don't want to, right? Baby, I'll be late for work. Come on, honey. You work for yourself. So you can go to work at 1 p.m. or any time you like. I have all day to spend with you, so you see, we don't have no. a problem. Yeah, um, baby. Yeah. Mm. Baby. Mm. Uh, baby, could you just answer that call? <laughs> Come on, let's have some quiet. I mean, what is it? Uh, uh, Madam. Uh, you're far God. I thank you. Thank you, God. Madam, good morning. Oh. Good morning. What is it? Sorry, ma. Madam, I don't they wait for a door, they knock since I don't see you. Now I say, let me call you. So because you don't see me, now you make it call my phone up and down like say one emergency day. I mean, what is it? Sorry, ma. I beg no fake, so. I'll wait for you, ma. Sorry. My friend, don't call this phone again. Huh? Sorry, ma. There. She won't be calling again. Baby. You know, she could be a bother sometimes, you know. <sighs> hey, Mecca. Huh? Doesn't this remind you of when we just got married? We used to spend days locked up. Phones were on silent and tossed away. Nothing could stop the flow of things. But now, anything and everything distracts you. We have been married for five years, yet no baby. 
And it's not like we're even trying hard enough. Honey, what's the problem? Is it that you don't... You see, this is it. This is a problem. What? All this nagging and tension and you wanting it badly. That's my problem with this whole thing. Please, would you just let me breathe? Huh? You must understand that I am very busy. Things are not the same as it was when we got married. Look, we are large. Larger than we ever imagined. Come on, baby. Things are different now, and that's a good thing. A good thing that I want to solidify and make permanent. Mm. Well, this good thing is beginning to look like a curse. And Becca, what exactly are you doing? How much more do you want to secure? How much longer am I supposed to wait? Ada, uh, things will soon be smooth, I promise. How soon is soon? Because you've been saying the same soon for the past five years. Look, I've waited so long to have children, but you keep pushing me away with the excuse of wanting a balanced life before children. What is this, Emeka? Baby, I don't want our children to taste the kind of life that we had. God, God has blessed us. So, so how much more do you want? Wait, you want to own the whole world before you are satisfied? Emeka, we are ready to have children. You have a lucrative real estate business. We we'll have a house so big that it can house 10 children or more if we choose to. So what else do you want? Hey, babe, Ada, my mind is still not at peace. There's too many distractions, too many things I need to attend to. Look, I don't want our kids to have nothing short of the best. Please, baby, see reason with me. Listen, this will be over before you know it. Are you really sure about that, Emeka? Are you? Are you? Because the business will continue to expand. And what if in another five years, the business continues to grow? Will you be able to stop then? Baby, don't worry. I got this. No, you don't! You don't! I'm tired! There's always something more important than me. Something more needing of your attention than children. What is it? Are you important? Okay, you need to stop! You know this conversation takes me off and yet you continue. Especially when we get a chance to close you up. How am I supposed to get turned on like this? No, 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 don't you dare! Don't you dare put this on me! You don't get it up because you can't, or you choose not to. You don't have control over your body because you are distracted. Oh, I try, I have tried to get you started, but you let what get into your head and get you distracted. So don't you dare I, put this on me! I'm done. Big responsibilities even come with bigger adjustments. You need to understand that. Look. I need to get ready for work. There's so much we'll lose if I don't go. Oh, oh, oh yes, and off he goes! Off he goes again! To his room, then to his workplace. And then when he comes back at night, I'm asleep. And even when I wake up for him, he is tired. That is if I'm privileged enough to be graced with his presence. Because sometimes he may vamoose from his office to somewhere in the world, like China or America, only to return a few days later with gifts. Vanity upon vanity! That is the norm I constantly deal with. And when I complain, I become the problem! I become the nag! <laughs> but, uh, you need to get it together before you lose it completely. Go! Go! Just go! Go! <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, madam. Morning. How are you? All is well, ma. What are you making for breakfast? Madam, the food where I get for mine, they make. You know, get name, but you enjoy it. Don't, don't make for me. I'm not feeling very well. Just make for God only. Eh. Oh, madam, sorry. Eh. Should I make you pepper soup? You know it's good for morning sickness. So. <coughs> Yummy.
Uh -uh. Listen, don't worry. I'll get to it immediately. You know, securing those plots is foremost on my mind and I will not sleep until I do so. <laughs> Look, Benny, it's no secret that each plot on that land in the next 10 years will be worth 500 million naira. That's why it's going so fast. And that's why we'll grab it now while we can for 50 million. <laughs> Me, I'm not going to wait for 10 years. Two, three years, I've sold mine. You go. <laughs> ah. That's how we make money, you know? Anyway. I'm about to head to the office now. Um, I will give you a call when I get in, and then we could talk more. Hey, Benny, Benny, my God! <laughs> All right, then. What is it? I'm fine. God day. I don't say God day, but what is it? Ego, you know my problem now, so why do you keep asking me? <sighs> why now? Where are you day? I'm at home. Clear me for your estate gate before you forget. Hey, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy you came. Thank it's you. It's nothing. Let's go eh? Climb four flights or 60 steps. I beg. Me and my husband, we had enough exercise last night. Eh? Thank you very much. Babe, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. So no, sorry. please don't. Don't apologize for having a blissful marriage. Oh God, I'm so sorry. Don't do that, please. No, no, don't, don't. I mean, it is scarce, so you have to enjoy it. Have you tried talking to him? Are you seriously asking me that, Ego? I have talked and talked so much to my husband that he now calls me a nag. But how can you hit the nail on the head when there's a clear distance between the wall and the hammer? <sighs> Babe, you miss it. Are you Virgin Mary? Look, for action to take place, there must be fusion. And how can fusion take place when he's never around? I don't know. Honestly, I don't. And even when he's at home, he stays up in his room, working. <laughs> but Ada, how can you allow your husband to stay alone? And ho how can the two of you have separate rooms? Honestly, Eko, I don't know. Eh? It all started like Fono, when we were building. The architect made provision for Madame's room and honestly, I thought it would be fun to have a space where I'll display all my shoes, my bags, my jewellery, you know. I thought, you know, it would be nice to have a place to go to when we quarrel. In fact, <laughs> I had scenarios in my head that I'd lock myself up after the fight and he'd come knocking and begging. Besides, I also heard it'll be good for me to have my room when I have a baby. But now, when I think about it, my friend, hey, that was, that was my undoing. Because as you know, we have been waiting for five years to have a baby. And in those five years, Emeka and I have grown apart. Eh? He has even turned his room to a semi-office that he locks up sometimes for the fear of documents being tampered with. <laughs> this is not good. It's not good. This is not good at all. I mean, me and my husband have been married less than you guys. And we're already on our third one. Wait. You're pregnant? Yes, I am. Two 
ones. Congratulations, my friend. Jay Eko. Honestly, I envy you. Hey, what, 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 what have I gotten myself into? Eh? How can a man be so busy that he neglects his wife? Important. I don't know. I have asked him that same question several times. Please, my friend, tell me. What do I do? I don't, I don't know, honestly. Look, only you can make yourself happy. Otherwise, you will continue to gloat in misery. My friend, please, just. What, what, what do I do? I'm, 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 I'm losing my I'm mind. Start by working. I don't understand why you will stop working because you guys came into money. I know so many rich women like you who their husbands uh, have money and they're still working now. Huh? Okay. I'll consider that. But you know it was the same Emeka that asked me to stay home to take care of the kids that are yet to come. What is this? Eh? What sort of punishment is this? What is this now? Mm -hmm. Adele, this is not the time to cry. So he wants you to stay at home, Abi, while he goes out there doing his work. Oh yeah, stay at home now. Akuya, listen, I don't want to be the one to advise you. Before they say it is Ego that advised you. He wants you to stay at home. Stay at home. Abi, so that there will be peace. Mm -hmm. oh, dear. Let me run along. What is this now? What is it now? What? I'm your friend, Ego. Tell me what to do, please. Okay, babe. Keep doing what you're doing. Looking good, dressing up, driving his cars, chopping his money. Continue doing what you're doing now. Abby, what do you want me to tell you? And thanks for seeing me on such short notice. Very good work you're doing here. Thank you. It's our pleasure doing what we do. I mean, instead of uh, unwanted babies being abandoned or killed, we ask incapable parents and unwilling parents to put them up for adoption. We thank God for what he has used us and he's still using us to do. That's very impressive. Very. Um, sister, mm -hmm. as I disclosed to you over the phone, I'd like to know the possibility of adopting a child, a baby, an infant. Oh yes, madam. I have looked through your credentials and your status no doubt qualifies you for a possible adoption. Oh, that's good to hear. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, however, because of the specific need for an infant, we are limited. Although there's a woman who came here two weeks ago, fresh out of delivery, she registered her interest, but insisted that she wants to breastfeed the baby for six months before the handover. Oh, that's so sweet of her. <laughs> Look, I can wait. To be honest, I was worried about how I would handle an infant, you know? But I just thought an infant would be easy to bond with me and fit into the overall picture, you know? <laughs> I know, madam. If you like, I can arrange for the both of you to meet. You know, get to know each other, see the baby, and break this uh, stranger barrier that usually frightens the styler. I always advise that so that there's um, a formed friendship of some sort before the handover. That's, that's good. I mean, I, I don't mind. I'd like to meet them. All right. Yeah. Good then. <laughs> Thank you so much. Sister. You're welcome. Yeah. You're welcome. The pleasure is ours. Yes. <laughs>
For me, never. Thank you. Thank you, my sister. Thank you. Thank you. Hey. Hey. My dear. What you are doing is good. Giving up your child for adoption and better care. Well done. Say this thing you won't do for me good. Madam, it is anything good to the send my children, so okay. So why you can't they do one? Are you really sure about this? You don't think this thing well well? Yes, I don't think I'm well well. Make you no worry. I will give them to you, but first make her breastfeed her. You know, say, that one I have gift from God. I free it. My mom say, breast me, they make picking strong, well, well. I make her know they fail to do her. To sell her feet. I feel the breastfeed reach one year. But, as I know they shop when well, my breast they pick dry. How many children you get? My number four be this. Where the other ones them they? Don't carry their gift to people. Yabo. Why you they sell your children they give people? Come, I hope say this thing no be business where you and your husband they do because it no go good. Mother, why they talk like this now? Why go happy to send my children? One woman went there my church where, where no fee born. Now I carry give my first two children. The other one and my sister carry them. As I come here by Madame Shira, now I go meet her. This is not the first time where I go carry my picky give stranger calling money. Your husband no fee give you small money, make you take the do small business, get small money, take the feed your children. <laughs> Madam, no be person where you get money, go fee give person money. My husband a useless man, yo. No close mouth talker, I saw it be. Now so so to drink, drink, now it's a big drink. With the small, uh, uh, my, uh, mama put what they do, now so it go, they chuck her the inside, now it don't finish. Uh, my sister, I beg no vex for this question I won't ask you. Eh? But after you born the first one, born the second one, come born the third one, why you come born another one? Madam, my husband know they let me rest you. I so so do do now with the do. Morio, afternoon, night, every time I so so do do. He say, once my body. Touch and say, your whole body go catch fire. And as you see, now my house is small. So now, so, so I will touch our body, they touch where we I see. I understand. <laughs> Me and my husband been there like that. We meet when they do youth service. We can't engage for them. That time, chai. Nobody fit separate us. Oh, <laughs> I won't finish with service. We can't marry. Two of us can't put money together, can't get more small, one room apartments. It's big past this is not small. Hmm. Not all good. Now morning, afternoon, night. 
me and my husband that time. Now every time, hey, small thing like this, once our body touch, now so fire go begin to catch us. They catch us like say, fire won't burn the house. Chai! Oh. <laughs> Hi, that time, eh, me and now, we did so close. Eh, we go enter bus, go walk together, come back together. Sometimes we wait for each other for bus stop. Hey, God. And when we still reach house, now so touch him, but he could still continue. Hey, sister. I wish I could change time. It was the best part of my marriage, my sister. Hey, I go. Do you not cry? Eh? <laughs> Don't worry, God will give you a new picking. You hear? Eh? Uh, I don't we'll give this one to you. Make a proceed and finish. Joe, eh? don't cry, yeah? Hi. Let's see, Iabo. I don't want to make you sell this begin. I won't make you take care of him well, well. But you must promise me one thing. Say, if I give you money to take that business, you go do him well, well. You hear me so? Take this one. Eh? Use and buy food. Start to feed yourself. Ah, eh? Take hey, care God of yourself. God bless you. Just manage until I can't give you money for your business. You hear? I beg. Look after this picking for me. I beg. Don't sell your picking again. I beg. I don't go sell her. I go come see you, yeah? I do be my Eshi. Get up, no they kneel down. Get up My God, go bless you. Eshi. No they do this kind. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Thank you, Thank you, ma. Thank you. Thank you. Why, my sister? My God, go bless you. God, go bless you too. Thank you. Take care, eh? I will come see you. Eshi, 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 ma. Bye bye. Eshi, thank you. Which can angel visit me so? Eh? If to say no follow mother, she rako I for say no angel be this you. Eh? Oh. Ah. And look my Jesu. Ah. Oluwa. Oluwa. Ah. Oluwa she. Ah. Oluwa. Eh. Ila to be you. Aribiti Arabata Eyila Tobiju Aribiti Arabata Eyila Tobiju Oluwa Grant my prayer. I remember when I cried to you six years ago. <laughs> I cried to you about Emeka and I. I cried to you concerning our then struggling position. And you indeed heard my prayer. <laughs> you increased us in abundance. You increased my husband Emeka much more than I asked for. You set us up in high places. You took us from the gutters and set us up in high places. And for that, Father, I say thank you. I give you all the glory. I give you all the adoration and I thank you, Lord. But Father, <laughs> Father Jehovah, today I ask for a complete reversal of all those blessings. Father Jehovah, demote my husband and make a silence a joke. Father, return him back to nothing. Take him back to the days when he just met me. Take him back to when he sought your face, Father. Father, I remember I cried. 
attached to your humility. I challenged you with a portion that says in the Bible that when a man finds a wife, he finds a good thing. I needed good things to happen in my marriage. Perhaps I was not specific. Perhaps my heart was yearning for more help instead of an all-around increase. But Lord, you indeed heeded my challenge and you granted my request. You heard my prayers. In fact, you blessed us abundantly, Father Jehovah. But Lord, today I challenge you again in grief. Father Jehovah, it seems that those blessings that you have bestowed upon us has become our temptation and is casting dark shadows in our household. So, Father Jehovah, I say, take it away. Lord, Father, in the name of Jesus, roll it all away, Jesus. Father, today I'm going to be specific. Take us back to a one room apartment, Father. Lord, please answer my prayers. Lord, answer the prayers of your daughter today. Father, grant my prayer request, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, come into my life and grant my prayer request for the only God that I have, the only God that I serve. Father Jehovah, oh, hear my prayers and wipe away my tears, Father. Lord, hear my prayers. Oh. Because I believe that you have heard my prayers and you have granted my request, Lord. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. When did you come in last night? Uh, three o'clock in the morning. I already checked in you, but you're fast asleep on the floor. Babes, are you okay? So, why are we talking on the phone now? Why can't you come check on me since you got up first? Or are you not interested in finding out if all is truly well with me? Babes, I've already been down here twice. I thought you were down here now. I hope all is well with you because... I don't think I have the energy to climb back upstairs. I see. The chef said you didn't tell him what to prepare for breakfast. Eh, tell him what you want now. Are you not downstairs there with him? Uh, okay. Bassi. Bassi. Sir. Prepare yam and sardine sauce for me. Okay, sir. All right. Go. Hello? Could you come down for a minute? There's something I want to discuss with you. Uh, I'm a bit weak. Besides, I'm not a decent. So why don't you meet me halfway? Okay. investment I told you about, the new Lagos Resort Beach now selling. Yeah, the, didn't you say it was too expensive? 50 million per plot? Yes, the projection is amazing. <laughs> I mean, in one to two years, that land will more than double or triple its price. I mean, imagine what that would do for us. But do you have that kind of money? 
I thought you said you invested quite a huge sum in buying three lands oil shares. So where would you get the money from? The bank is ready to give me a loan. They actually see the potential. Okay. I've decided to invest in 10 plots. What do you think? Why are you asking me what I think when you've already decided? Emeka, please go ahead with your plans. But while you're at it, please transfer 5 million naira into my account. There's something important I'd like to do with it. Okay. As soon as I get to the office, I'll do that. Meanwhile, I need you to do something for me. I want you to pray for this investment. You know how your prayers work like magic. Huh? And we need this desperately, you know? Emeka, uh, there is nothing I need more desperately right now than children. So please, don't add me to your list. Besides, you can pray to God for your own needs yourself. We all have equal access, you know. Come on now, you know I have lost touch with prayer and all now, you know. Wow, and you're proud to say it. Uh, look, I am very busy, you know. So busy that you have not been to church in almost two years. No wonder the Bible says that it will be easier for a camel to pass through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to see the kingdom of God. Matthew chapter 19, verse 24. Mark chapter 10, verse 25. Ada, I don't need this right now. And I am not in a right frame of mind to seek the Lord in prayers for any kind of investment. Why? Because I am angry, Emeka. I am bitter. I am sad. And I cannot for the life of me understand why Ada, you keep- Your food is already here. Well, go on then. You don't want your food getting cold. Ah, welcome you. Yes, how are you? Welcome, man. No, they Hello. call me Ma. My name is Naada. Okay? Yes, ma. Yeah. yeah. So, um, how are you? Sister Shima talks to you, you're picking nowhere. Hey, you go inside. Uh, but uh, Madame Shira knows the look. Huh? Okay. Uh, welcome. Mm -hmm. Welcome, ma. See, uh, go bring Jess to I won't tell you something. Okay, ma. See, I don't talk to Sister Shira. And I feel for my spirit to help you. I won't carry you go bank. Made an open account for you with five million naira. They will come give you financial advisor. After you don't think what you won't carry your money do, you go come tell them. You go help you organize your market. You hear me so? Mother, why they help me like this? Who you be? Eh? What's that? Why they help me like this? What I'm going to give you now? You know what my children? What I'm going to give you I know what they I do. Hey. See, I get do up, get up. I love me. I'm going to get up. See, get up, get up. Get up, get up. Come on for that place where you did. Sit down. I know, see, see. I don't want to make you give me anything. The only thing I want to make you do for me you see, I will make you better your life. Take care of your children. And if you fit, I beg, go bring back all your children then when you don't sell. You hear? Yeah. I know that thing. Your <coughs> husband, help her. Make you get help. Make you stop till they drink. So that when you don't do okay, all of them are going to together. They do everything together. You hear me, so? I don't hear you, man. I don't hear you, man. God, God bless you. I do swear. I love God, God bless you. God, God give you children. You don't help me. God, God help you. I do swear, man. I love God, God bless you. I go inside, go ready. Thank you. You don't go now. Go, go, go. Shima, oh, hello.
who exactly will understand my plight now? Who do I share my pain with? My parents say I must be patient. And his parents think I'm rushing him and may slow his progress. Ego. Ada. Uh. What are you doing in my estate? No. <laughs> How are you? Good to see you too. How are you? Fine. You? I'm good too. Is it the husband neglecting you thing again? I think I'm tired. Anyway, I really don't want to talk about it. Am I a stranger now that you will not talk about it with me? No, no. I just came here to clear my head. It's okay. I understand. Congratulations on the naming ceremony. I'm so sorry I couldn't attend. You know how emotional I get when it comes to things like that. So. I know. Kaide and I are no longer together. It's really been long ago. Well, that's because you stopped coming to my place. Did they forbid you to come to the mainland every time you want me to come to the island, but you won't reciprocate? Eh? You didn't even come to my baby's naming ceremony. So I decided to leave you so you can hang with the caliber of people that you belong to, and I hang with mine. Ego, why would you hold such contempt without telling me? It's not contempt, it's keeping it real. Okay. Anyway, I'm on a date, so. Let me go back to my date. Wait. What? I don't understand. What kind of date? <laughs> my dear, me and Kaidi are no longer together. He couldn't take care of me and the kids, so I left though, looking for greener pastures. What are you talking about, Ego? How can you leave your husband just because he doesn't take care of you the way you want? At least I know that Coyote can afford the basics. So. Oh, so it is me who is good for managing the basics. When you live in a house as big as a hostel, eh? So I should manage with that 90,000 a month earning salary husband. Eko, where is all this venom coming from? Nowhere! Okay? It's not coming from anywhere. Look, some of us handle things very differently. Like you, if I was in your shoes, I would go and get somebody else to impregnate and pin it on my husband and not sit there gloating for somebody who doesn't give a hoot about you or care about you. Oh, okay. Ah, all right. You know what? You've said enough. Thank you. I'd like you to leave me alone now. Please. I will. Bye-bye. Honestly, Pastor, I don't know what to do again. I'm tired in my soul, in my body, in my spirit. I'm just weak, Oliver. And it's like, even when I try to be strong, I feel. I'm so sorry, my sister. Exactly the way you feel. I would like to talk to your husband, so have him come see me. Pastor, I think it'll be better if you come and speak to him yourself. Because it will not be any different from every other Sunday that I try to talk him into going to church with me. Hmm. What is he running away from? The truth, perhaps? You see, Sister Ada, the Bible says in Matthew chapter 6, verse 33, to seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and then every other thing shall be added unto you. So I don't understand why people quickly forget this aspect of the Bible. As soon as their initial prayer request is answered, they completely stop seeking the face of God. You know that if you do not seek, you won't find. And 
if you don't find, you will continue to search. And there is no other way to go about it but to continue to take this matter to the Lord in prayers. Pastor, I called you to advise me. Are you telling me to go and pray about it? I have prayed relentlessly. And to be honest, I'm almost tired of praying. Please tell me, as a human being, of flesh and blood, what do I do? Be patient. Show him love and kindness. Show him more understanding. And most importantly, allow God to take the wheels. You see, as humans, when we search for something that is not reachable, the best thing to do is to take it to the Lord in prayers. To tell you the truth, Sister Dan, that is the best advice I can give you concerning this matter. Wow. Thank you, Pastor. It is well, my sister. Thank you. didn't. You hurt me last time, Ego. No, no, no. You know they forget what person do you. But I don't come now. I do here. I need, I need your help. What kind? Financial. I see. I'm cash trapped. I didn't want to come to you, but I just had to. seen you in over a year and when I did you lashed out at me and now you managed to reach out to me and for what? Money? Why didn't you say so over the phone? I would have made a transfer. Why did you ask me here? I wanted us to see so that we could talk things through so I could say I'm sorry. I was angry. For what? Because you had money and you did not share. Are you serious? But you never asked. I don't know. You know, I needed help. But you never offered. Kaede took the kids and left because I didn't have substantial income to look after them. And you, you had money in excess. But you did nothing. Are you kidding me right now, Ego? Wait, how am I supposed to get into your head to know what you want? Besides, you didn't even tell me you were planning to separate from Kayabe. Calm down now. Your body today hot. Babe, I need a loan of two million naira. I'll give you the money, but it's not a loan. Zero 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 mm -hmm. nine zero. Yes. Six three five. Uh huh.
Oh, this can't be right. Oh. Let me let me call my account manager quickly. Okay. Hello, Shay. Yeah, how are you? Um, please, can you confirm my last withdrawal? Yeah. It was five million. No, it wasn't 50 million. You saw the slip. Ah, better... Yeah, investigate it quickly and get back to me. Ah. What is it? I'm not really sure what's going on, but my... account balance doesn't tally with my last withdrawal. Ah. Anyway, I'm sure it will be... You'll be fine, they're investigating it anyway. I hope you won't collect this money that you just brought me oh, back. come on, I'm not going to collect it back from you. <laughs> I have to run. I want to make something special for Emeka. Okay. My pastor says that I should continue to shower him with love and care, however long it takes. <laughs> and as for you, I promise. I'll come regularly to check on you and the baby. All right? Yes, darling. Thank you. Kiss the baby for me. Yes. You're an angel. I, I beg you, that's no, all. No, I, I mean I it now, exactly. babe. Exactly. <laughs> Take thank care, okay? Yes, thank, thank you. you. Thank you, babe. Bye. Thank you so Bye. much. <laughs> Welcome, Mary. Uh, thank you. How are you? Oh, oh. What are you doing here? Maka, what's wrong? And why are you home so early? It's only two o'clock. Hey, Maka. You are scaring me. What's wrong? There has been a declaration that the area marked for the development of the beach resort is unfit for housing. Can you imagine? A land that has spent over 500 million has been referred to as no good and dangerous. One that his entire land mass will be washed in water. Even the state government has declared interest to reclaim the land. The news of the decline has spread so fast that people are pricing five million a plot. Five million for something you bought for 50 million Naira? Real estate. Well, I don't, so what are you going to do then? Are you going to sell or stall for more offers or what? From whom? Individuals are looking for a chance to own something that will appreciate. <sighs> okay, so what about the company that sold to you? Can't you get your money back? After all, they deceived you all into our position. From the sea. Everybody has disappeared into the air. Oh goodness. What is happening? Father Jehovah! Today I ask for a complete reversal of all those blessings! Father Jehovah demotes my husband and make a silence in Kyoko. For I return him back to nothing. Take him back to the days when he just met me. You know what will happen if we don't pay back the loan, don't you? Wow. <laughs> I can't believe you just called me that. You haven't called me that name in ages. Are you listening to what I'm saying? The banks will come after us if we don't pay back in due time. Honey. Okay? 
Look, why don't you sell off your shares and pay back? What of Peter? Why don't you call him? Peter? Yeah, our business manager. I'm sure if he gathers all our shares together, he'll be able to come up with something substantial for you. Yeah, yeah, I think I'll do that. See? Everything will be fine. Just calm down. Okay? Peter, why are you staring at me like you've seen a ghost? I asked you, what share or shares can we sell? Honestly, Mr. Jugo, none for now. Well, maybe one, but that will not fetch you much at all. I would rather to wait for this recession to pass. Peter, in other words, I have very bad news, Mr. Jogu. Very bad news. Concerning your shoes. No, 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 no! <laughs> Trust in sense. Honey, please don't. Don't say things that you may regret. I mean, look at you. You're alive. So let's just thank God for your life. The accident was grave. Your car is irreparable. Oh, great. What else is irreparable? Oh, yes. I remember. I get to be in a wheelchair for God knows how long. How? Wonderful. I've lost my car. My shares gone. Please tell me again. Why am I supposed to be thankful for my misfortune? Ada. Ada. 
What's going on? Who, who's, who is this? Get me, get me out of this car! Is he your husband? Yes, he is. What's going on? What, what, what is the meaning of all this? Mr. Jogu, right? Yes! Please What's the matter? Please. Why are you asking my name? What is this? Yes. I beg you, eh? don't do this to me. This is the only house that I have. I have nowhere to go. I, I, I am begging you. Me and my wife. I this am is working where on the strict instructions of others. I know. Listen, if you want a reversal of this, you have to speak with the bank head. I know. I'm just saying that you know you can help me. Please, please, Adam? please. Come on. My husband had an accident. He's in a wheelchair. Please, just help me talk to your colleague. Ma'am, I can't do anything for you. Please. He's in a better position to help. I'm under strict instructions here. Please, go talk to him. Go back to him. But please, move out, no, outside. No, no. I'll have to involve I, the. I'll have to involve There the is no need for that now. Please, please I'm begging you. Please. Madam, please. madam, please. you can please. go inside and pick some of your personal please. belongings. My Officer, house. escort her in. I will sort out something with the bank. Let's go her into my house. I will sort the bank out. Listen, I will be at the bank tomorrow and I will sort out something with There is them. nothing I can do. There has to be something you can do. Ah, uh -uh. ah. Hey! Hey! Hey, hey. How do you need it? Your children, huh? they are here. Indeed, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Why is my son in a wheelchair? Will someone start talking? What happened to my son? He had an accident. Did the accident affect his tongue? Eh? No, Mama. I'll be fine. The wheelchair is supposed to help ease the tension of my leg. In no time I'll walk again. I see. Anything else I should know? Your appearance is suspicious. Papa, I've lost everything now. Mm -hmm. I don't know who I've offended or why this is happening to me. But there seems to be a rapid loss of everything I have struggled for over the years. My goodness. Yes! Yeah. Yeah, hey, Adam. I see you. What? Big problem. What? I don't know, but two years ago I I prayed for my husband's downfall. Now it seems like my prayers are being answered. Well, uh, could it be a coincidence? <sighs> I mean, how could you do such? How could you pray this such? What, what kind of prayer is that? I don't know. Now I would. I, I don't know. I was feeling down and bad. I wanted my husband near me. You know, I wanted us back where we started, and now it seems we are. How? Everything is gone, Igor. The house, the cars, the money, everything. I mean, it's like magic. We're even in his parents' house now. Okay, so, I suppose the two of you are in one room now? Yeah, they have three bedrooms there. Well, at least you're in the same room. You got your wish. I know, but there's so much tension in the air. Well, you just have to try. Time waits for no man. And you're almost 40. Don't forget. I know how hurt you feel. 
And if I could change time for your sake, I would. I'd do anything to see you happy again. I understand. Oh, but baby, stop sounding as if you're the cause of all. Not now. <laughs> Not in this my state of mind. Ah. With you, there is never a right time. Emeka, what is it? What? Is it me? Am I no longer attractive to you, Emeka? What is it? We've been sleeping on the same bed for the past how many months? Yet nothing! What is it, Emeka? Wait, wait, wait. What? Look, I don't have time for this. I am going through enough hassles already. Emeka. You know what your problem is? You don't know how to act for sex. Are That's you selfish? Why? Are you kidding? Can we not talk about I'm this thing? What is this? What? Emeka, Darling. must you go anywhere? Can we not sort this thing out here? Emeka! Emeka! Blessings, Father Lord, and perhaps he may just have my time again, and perhaps he may just be happy again. Lord, please, Lord, please. You, you are an abomination. My son will never look at you again. Ebualo, Mama Bikozian, Bikogini, Mama Bikogini, come and chat again. I can explain. It's you not you what explain you what? Mama, you explain what? what? Think, Mama, please. You plotted Emeka's downfall for your own selfishness. Okay. Oh, yeah? No, Mama, Mama, you want to explain? What do you want to explain to me? Mama, Mama, it's not like that. Please, Mama. I can explain. No, let me tell you. Before I do you something bad, pack your things and leave this house. Oh, you here? You're going Mama, be cool. Mama. Concerning their husband's refusal to lay with them. Will you tell them to pray for their downfall or that things will get better? Mama, I, I didn't think it through. I prayed that prayer out of frustration and misery. What kind of frustration will make you say such a terrible prayer? This is a disappointment, Ada. And I never expected it from you. Jay! Mama, Hey, Pico, Mama, Papa, Pico, only was anyway. Eh? 
I, I didn't know what I was thinking. I was in an emotional state. Please, I'm, I'm, I'm truly sorry. I understand, my daughter. Hmm? Go, on, go and rest now. Yes, ma'am. To kill how? She should have thought about it before taking such a step. I feel you. into your home, regardless of the present circumstances. It shows you are good people. You have done no wrong, my beloved. It is your daughter who has committed an abomination. together and try to understand why she did what she did. Biko, how can you suggest such arrant nonsense, Mrs. C.K.? That your daughter prayed to ruin our son and you are asking us to see reasons with her? Was she not in her right senses when she made that useless prayer? Anna Majuno. Zanono. Eh? Sissy. Calm down. You are channeling your anger to the wrong person. She did not advise her daughter to do so. Papa Mecca, please caution your wife. She is going out of hand. The way your daughter has gotten out of hand. Sisi, excuse us, please. I know you are angry. Excuse us before you say things you will regret later. No, I will. I will do that. But I will not keep quiet and watch these people talk nonsense from their mouths. <laughs> um, please. Do not take what she says to heart. She speaks out of anger. Papa Emeka, I understand. I probably would have acted worse in the same situation. Only the fear of the Lord and my upbringing will not allow me. My Lord, please let us reason this thing very well. It sounds stupid indeed it is. But we remember we advised our daughter when she came to us, complaining that her husband was continuously not complying in the baby making assignment. When she came to you, we were told you advise her to be more patient. That is correct. Years after, she came back to us complaining that her husband was still not performing his duties. Mm -hmm. Her pain was not disguised this second time. She opened up and explained to us how they were living. My daughter confessed to us that her husband does not touch her regularly, especially when she needs him to do so. During her onset periods, sometimes he doesn't touch her 
a tough moment. It was a sad day for me. Because I never believed I could be discussing such a thing with my daughter. You know, sometimes it is better to leave these things to the imagination. But for her to open up the second time, it must have been her very well. Hmm. So, I understand the frustration that led her to believe that the source of her problem is a maker's word and his busy schedule. And so, she decided to pray for his doom? Huh? My love, I understand her pain. But I am ashamed that you see reasons with her prayer. Well, you have the right to feel so. But I'm not ashamed to say that I understand where that pain came from. I really do. I leave you to think about it. We cannot force you to make any decision. But sending my daughter away is rather too hasty. We will leave now. Chichi, let us go. Come on. Go well. Hello? Ada, why? Baby, I'm sorry. I wish you could see my heart to know how truly sorry I am. Well, I don't want to. Your heart smells foul. That's not true, Emeka. Please, look, everything I did was for you, for your love. Why are you so selfish? While I was busy out there trying to build a future for our children, you were busy tearing me apart! How could you be so selfish? That's not true, Emeka. Look, I'm a 39-year-old woman who wants four kids and I don't have time on my side. Well, you have the kids now, don't you? Emeka, please, can we sit face to face and talk about this? Please, I love you. I hate you! I hate you for your selfishness and everything else that you stand for. Please, for the love of everything that you care for, do not call me again. I am better off without you. Emeka! Out of anger. You don't understand. 
This is torture. <laughs> Actually, I don't understand. Because I know how long you've been praying for kids. Huh? Is this the best you could do? I guess I deserve it. I know what's done is done and you can't turn back the hands of time. What you need to do now is think about what you're going to do moving forward. I don't know what to do. I, it's not like I have um, a substantial amount of money to start something tangible. I can give you one million naira. How? From mm. where? From the money you gave me. I gave you two million months ago. What, you didn't touch it? I did. But I can spare one million. Or better still, you can join me in this restaurant business I'm doing. You can be partner. You have a restaurant? My dear, I do. It's my mom who introduced me to this restaurant business. Even got somebody to help me set it up. The woman who owns the franchise is a member of her church and gave a testimony of the business. <laughs> Every idle person my mother knows is pretty much into this selling of food. To hear. Look, I know you're feeling wussy right now, but you need to get up and go. Okay? And the offer remains. But I'm, I'm honestly happy for you, Dominic. Thank you, my dear. I'll soon be moving out of this place. And you can come and rent it if you want to. You know, you're the only person in the whole wild world. We know like better things. So then some of us will become big girls, riding big cars, please, carrying Gucci and Che. Please, please, please. Uh, I'm just playing. Please, don't remind me. Okay, I'm just playing now. Uh-uh, big madam, my Ada baby. Give it here, give it here, give it here, give it here. <laughs> Sissy, is the food not ready yet? Dim, I will soon be done. I hope you can wait. Do I have a choice? <laughs> I want you to talk to your maker. About? You know what? What do you want me to tell him? Remember when we first got married? Mm -hmm. For years, you complained about my preference to sleep on a sofa in the parlor. Uh -huh. So where is this going? When I didn't stop, you broke the wood, holding the bottom of the sofa, and later blamed me for spoiling it when I fell flat on it. Uh, at least it got you to come to bed, didn't it? That is exactly my point, Sissy. Um, sometimes women do drastic things to get the attention of their husbands. Yes, Shinedu, my friend, once told me how his wife mixed kerosene in all the bottles of the Ogoguro drink he sold because she wanted him to discontinue selling liquor. His customers that day complained terribly of stomach pain and his business collapsed right after that. But guess what? He is still with that woman up till today. And don't forget, I'm still with you. Edim, are you categorizing the small thing I did with the big destruction Ada cost our son? However different the size of problem caused is, the intention is the same. Don't get me wrong, Sissy. I am not justifying her actions, but let us learn to tolerate others' mistakes, forgive and forget. Um, okay. 
I will talk to Emeka, but it would have been the best if he had come from you. You will come back to me. And I will continue from where you will stop. Aye. Nay. So, it has been planned all this while. Eh, what? <laughs> that hunger is starting to <laughs> peak right now. Please, hurry with the food. Don't mm? worry, I'll bring your food for you right away. Okay. <laughs> ah, Dimo. down too. You know the land crash now, but you know as we say, the downfall, downfall of a man is not, not the end of life. life. <laughs> <laughs> no, Good to see you, bro. Good to Good see, to see, see you, you too. Good to Good see you, you too. Mm. No, man. Mm. I'm sorry about all your losses. Bro. Yeah, but it's a terrible thing, but you had some losses too, and, but I can see you still have your house. Huh? Well, I thank God, and I know you will pick up soon too. But okay, women are wicked. Women are wicked! So, because they think they have the power to declare anything declarable, they, they, they feel they can misuse it anyhow. Now shut up, Zayed. Uh -uh. Who says you don't have the same power? Okwaya? We men, we forget our duties as the spiritual head of the home. We forget what we possess and automatically pass it under the women who are everly ready to take that spiritual position in the home. Uh-uh. I never thought about it that way. And my pastor never explained it that way as well. Uh -uh. Man, he said he's busy telling me to fast for one month and... Forget that thing. Eh? Hada loves you. She did what she did out of love. In fact, you serve, you, you fall my hand. Fall your hand, say what it happened. Uh -uh. Because you are not doing your duty as a correct husband. We don't look for you, Taya. Ah, I will go meet her. That bank man, where you carry me, go meet. He say no, no, that you don't travel, come up from country. Eh, Madam Shira, she say she go call, you know, go pick. Eh, I collect your number, I call, you know, go. My sister, ah. I know. 
I've been they go through some kind things, so I just shut everybody out. Ah, ah. Madam, wait till me the problem. Ah, I beg, I beg, we'll leave that one first. Yeah. <laughs> How will this one take? <laughs> You know, say when my friend tell me, say, now her mama church member, hey. help her set up her business. Hey. I know if I believe, say it could be you. <laughs> this world's small, no, it's not. Madam, for now you, now nah you can't say more. Remember that thing, uh, 5 million, where you give me? That money, it don't reach over 70 million. <laughs> now lie. Ah, not true. <laughs> In less than three years. I'm not saying you're not going to believe me, but not true. How that one? Are you serious? <laughs> In fact, I know say you're the rich woman, but I don't talk. See, anytime when I see you, say, I go tell you thank you my own small way. <laughs> Ooh, I'm happy to see you. Well, well, uh, just, just take on a small thing when I get. <laughs> why, why are you going to give me this kind of money? Yeah? <laughs> 10 million naira. Ah, uh, what you do for me? Pass 10 million. Ah. See my ass now. See my, you don't tell my ass to happy you. Ah, see my husband now. You don't say that poverty now, they make a drink like a... Uh, <laughs> ah. Yes, so my sister. Ah. Um, I know they drink strong drink again. Hey. But uh, if I want drink, I just I they drink small. <laughs> That one good. You good ah. like that. Ah, Madam, you get one other thing when you advise me that time. You say make I try go carry my children. All of them they with us now. Now then be this. She. <laughs> the picture fine. I shame you. Yeah, I'm so proud of you. You know, saying that some people they could just they could just chop that money. They don't go do anything. Well, we'll see you. See what you do achieve. You do well. Tulu, you do well. Ah, madam, now you will go thank you. Ah, yes, now you will go thank you. See my house now. Everywhere don't set. My house don't decolate. Ah, poverty will be good to you. Poverty, no be good thing. May nobody pray for her. If you do inside, make you ask of me, carry you come up from inside. And if you don't do inside, make you thank Baba God well, well, because that is not a blessing. I'm not sure you talk. <sighs> thank you, my sister. God go bless you. Thank you, Google. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello? Hi. Hi. Did you just send me some money? Yes. Ten million? Yes. Why? I only returned what I took from you. How? Did you save it? Or, or did you invest with it? Actually, no. Yes, no. Which one is it? You remember when I asked you for five million and another one shortly after that? Yes. 
it was to help squander your money and speed up the lost process I still wanted to happen badly. I see. Well, one of the beneficiaries invested well and decided to pay back. I see. Look, Emeka, I know how much you must hate me for this, but there's really no point in lying anymore, is there? And I know that no amount of money I return to you will replace the hurt I cost you. So please, just use the money to start something. And with God on your side, I'm sure you'll make it back to the top in no time. But Emeka, please, when you get back to the top, do not neglect your partner or your wife. Whoever that may be. Take care now. Bye. Wait! Ada. Yeah? I don't think I want to start afresh with anyone else. I don't see how that will be possible. What are you saying, Emeka? What I'm saying is that I'm sorry for the way I handled this. And I'm sorry for saying I hate you because I don't. I could never hate you, even if I tried. I'm only mad at you. Well, I was mad at you. But I'm not anymore. <laughs> oh my, Emeka. God, you don't know how happy I am to hear this, God. Oh, thank you. I truly am sorry. I am so sorry. I love you so much. And I do hope you forgive me. Of course, I forgive you. You have? Yeah, baby. I mean, after much thought, so I think I might have overreacted. No, 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 don't say that. You didn't. I crossed the line. Now I know I could have done things differently. Oh, my God, God. I'm so happy to hear this. Thank you. I love you so much. I love you too. Can we meet at Oke's place tomorrow? Okay. I look forward to seeing you. I am looking forward to it too. Oh my God. Thank you. No. Don't thank me. Thank you. <laughs> okay. If you say so. <laughs> okay. See you soon. Bye. Are you sure? Yes. He says we should meet at Okay's place. Hmm. What if he tries to kill you? Have you thought about that? Ego. Why would my husband want to kill me? Ha uh ha. -uh. Which can't talk be that self? You made him broke. He said he hates you. This is a man who likes money. Now he says he wants to see you. Because you apologized or because you gave him 10 million. Ego, I really don't like the way you're sounding. I don't. This is my husband we're talking about for Christ's sake. What is it? Madam, I beg now your husband is still blue. So nothing will happen. Make you go meet them. And as they go, make you dress fine, fine, no. Come on, shut up your mouth! Get, get, get back to working. Can you imagine this girl? Dare you! Hi. Hi. Um, come in.
so sorry. Ada, ada nama ya. The wife of my youth. How could I be so blinded by power, money, and greed? How could I neglect the one person that stood by me and prayed for me tirelessly for my progress? My darling, I am sorry. I am wrong. Foolish. I am faulted. Please forgive me. I promise I will make it up to you if you give me a second chance. Please, my love. You don't need to ask because I definitely will. Emeka, you are my husband, my companion. The man after my own heart, my all. <laughs> to say I am surprised is underplaying my feelings right now. Thank you for wanting me back. Thank you for looking past my mistakes that has cost us so much pain. Living without you these past months has been torture. So thank you for turning it all around. I'm sorry. I can never stop saying no, it. No, no, I'm so sorry. Baby, please. Please, sweetheart. I am the one who should be sorry. I wronged you. I neglected your wants, your needs. I pushed you. I no, 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 listen. Let's put this all behind us and start afresh. Yes. Let's. <laughs> cool. I love you so much. I love you. <laughs> I put you present. Something nice. <laughs> <laughs> And some fine wine to celebrate. A new beginning. To a new beginning. To a new beginning. Cheers. Cheers. Mrs. Mm. Well, I know you must be spot for choices by now. These are beautiful houses. Mm. I would too. So having seen all the various types of apartments we have on offer, which one have you decided to go for? Well, we'll take the three-bedroom apartment. That's if that's okay by you. Actually, no. I'd like us to get a one-room apartment. Yes, babe, it's just the two of us. So let's start from there, even if it's just for one year. Baby, you know I don't do things like that. Well, hurry up the process of getting me pregnant. And if I take him, I promise we'll move to a two-bedroom apartment. And if I take him after that, mm -hmm. we'll move to a three-bedroom apartment. Or even a duplex, if you like. Okay. Deal. <laughs> Brutus? Sir. <laughs> you take the one room. Oh, one room is this? Yes. Uh, all right, sir. I shall be expecting you. <laughs> okay. 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 It's okay. 